Hi guys, welcome to Grudy's Racing Rest Day. Sunday fun day, I don't know, 1am. I <laughs> uh, thought I'd show you what I've been up to. I just, everything I've done lately is all about selling stuff I don't need or creating something cool. I don't want to work, not a normal job, not like normal people. There's nothing against it guys, but you need to find something that you really enjoy. I, I get out of bed and I go and create. It's amazing. Today was a good day. Sunday, Father's Day. Got to see my lad late in the Arvo. And uh, today, I started a slow cook. Oh, man. Have I been cooking? I have so much cooking to do this week at school. And what I'm doing is I'll cook and I'll do slow cooks. All right? So I'll do a slow roast and then a slow cook. So my meat slow cooks... The one yesterday was a bowl of roast. Uh, today, it was a bowl of roast. It was on at half past 11, 20 past 11. We are eating it at 20 past 5. Yeah. Six hours slow cook. It broke up with the tongs. It was so good. It had uh, honey plum marinade. Only sat overnight. It uh, had veg, you know. Potato, carrots, pumpkin went in at the end. I broke some off and gave some to Daniel and he was just like, oh, wow. <laughs> it was so good. So uh, now I'm going to utilise that six-hour slow cook roast after we ate some today. And uh, tomorrow I cook four porterhouse steak that are soaking in honey, soy, garlic and chilli marinade. And they're going to be two or probably hour and a half in the oven on low, 130, 140. I'm, I'm cooking this stuff out. And they'll cook. And then I'll get a slow cooked stew on. And then they'll go in the stew. And the six hour slow cooked bowl will go in the stew. And I'll cook that for another six hours. And tomorrow night I'll have like <laughs> an absolute ridiculous slow cook. <laughs> it's good Sunday fun day this is stuff you've got to do and nothing beats being on the tools smelling something amazing cooking so hence wearing gloves stuff's happening good so I thought I'd show you something so best mate Kev came over last night he just thought he'd stop in he's a he's a he's a good dude rings me once a week check in make sure I'm alright I like to have a chat with him. I like to catch up with him. He's uh, he's good value, and uh, he kind of talked me into <laughs> polishing the big and ugly front plate. Look at this. It's done. I just got to put some Loctite on these little screws and just set the set the throttle blade. It's touching here, but that's that's. The seal on the two outer ones don't matter because they've got a blocking cup and the inside one doesn't. So it's only running one anyway. But yeah, Kev, thanks, mate. I'm glad you talked me into it. I was I was thinking it and then I was thinking, oh, I'll just paint it black and Royce wants it black and, oh, well, if he wants it black, he can paint over that Minto polish I think this is going to look killer. This going on a VF burnout car with a blown LS in it. Makes like 900, 960 horsepower or something silly. So the last one exploded. So there you go. Big and ugly is done. I'll put some Loctite on it tomorrow. Get that out and done. Got a few gearboxes. AOD's got to go. Tom's engine's got to go. So I've got to pallet stuff up. And that little eight speed over the back there, that's got to go. But yeah, oh yeah. Day Lily. All right, so yeah, big and ugly's uh, looking really good. So uh, other thing I wanted to touch on was work. Everyone we know, hold on. So most people go to work, right? And that's what you call it is work. And the word work straight away gives you a downer. Going to work. You know, guys, I don't go to work. 
I could probably get a lot more done if I consider it work. I consider what I do creation. I create shit. I transform stuff. I I make things cool. So the other day, I was shopping for my slow cook, and uh, I, I should start. I should start taking some photos of this stuff. My cooking's getting really good. Always been good at cooking. I was, just wasn't allowed in the kitchen for the last five years. Silly Billy her. Fuck, I could have cooked us some killer meals. <laughs> so anyway, I go to the food land. The young chicks are a little bit under the weather, a little bit of a cold. And um, nice chick, see her a few times, ask her how her day is, you know, usual shit. This is what you do. You ask people how they are, yada, yada, yada. Oh, not, not so good. And she's, and I've said, you know, oh, I'm great. Having a good day. I'm always having a good day. I wake up, I'm having a good day. And I said to her, I said, what's wrong? And she's, oh, work. And I said, it's not work. I said, I don't consider what I do work. I consider what I do creation. I said, you know, I, I build cars. And she goes, oh, oh, yeah, that sounds like fun. I said, and you, you're not at work. I said, you talk to every single person that comes through. So you're going to socialise. I said, see it that way. See it a different way. Guys, we, we all... How you perceive something is how it is. So if you perceive it as shit, it's going to be shit. If you perceive it as as fun and amazing, that's what it's going to be. doesn't matter how shitty it is. If you don't like it, change it. Job, house, life, whatever. You just do whatever you want to do. you only got one shot here. you got one one life. Why aren't you enjoying it? And if you're enjoying it, I'm out there too, doing the same stuff. I enjoy it. Doing stuff like this, that's cool. Look at that. Gotta love life. Thanks, guys. I hope you have. I hope you all have an absolute amazing week. This week, I've actually got to get some shit done. It is for this. If I'm not enjoying myself as well as doing this, it won't happen. Have a good night. See you guys.